Oh, you didn't have to. Well, I'm looking after you, ain't I? <sighs> you know, Lee used to have them nightmares. All them horrible things you see. That was nothing. But it wasn't. Look, I I've been talking to Mick and Linda. You done them sunny side down? Uh-huh. <sighs> and we thought that tonight... We're going to throw you a party. Why? I said let me tell him. <laughs> and every day we have our own little war hero. That's really kind, Mrs C. I... Mick's going to get out the bunting. <laughs> I was just doing my job. Yeah. Well, I think... Well, we think you're mm. amazing. I'm not amazing. Well, you are to me. But thanks for the, uh... I'm just... I'm just not really hungry. Nick, sorry. No. No, you wear it, son. It's an honour. <laughs> I, um, I get why you, you don't want all this. You know, most people, they'd be loving the attention, they'd be milking the life out of it, you know, but, but not you, you know, because the way you look at life is just, you know, it's, 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 it's a laugh, isn't it? You know, you, that's why you let everyone still call you halfway, you know, you just, you don't take life too serious, you know, so I can understand why... It's all a bit cringy. I was just doing my job. Yeah, but to us, it's not just a job, you know? You know, what I do down there, pulling pints, that's just a job. But what you and, you know, what my Lee did, that's just something that most of us, we just, we just can't get our nuts around it, you know? Because you're over there, and you're doing these things that we can't even imagine. So what we do is, is we, we, we try not to think about it. You know, you just, you're gone. And then you're back. And you come back and you're injured. You know, and you've got like shrapnel hanging out of you and it just, it just makes people realize what you do for us every single day. And people are grateful. And um, people are proud. You need to let them show that. You know, show your love and show your respect. I don't know when someone last threw me a party. <laughs> but it ain't straight. Do you want to get up here and do it? Mother. Come on, tell me. No, I wouldn't be surprised if I told you. Prince Harry. Hey, you've dropped your end again. Your special guest. Your special guest. He's going to stick a medal on you. She is joking. Oh, no, no, she's not joking. She's a surprise guest. Still can't believe you're doing all this. Oh, you practised your curtsy. There you go, mate. You didn't have to. You got another one for you after Linda was just telling me. Yeah, you've got some guts, boy. I'll give you that. Oh, I don't embarrass him. You just do what you have to. I'm a drink. Um, yeah, I, I'd love one. <laughs> Celebrate my new adventure. Oh, yeah. Yeah, I'm, uh, I'm going travelling. Oh. Yeah, see if there's more to the world than Albert Square. What's wrong with Albert Square? Well, nothing's wrong. Don't listen to her, she's winding you up. <laughs> well, let's just say that, um, I'm ready to go. I'll go get myself a drink. Well, there's plenty more fish. You and I never really went anywhere. No, you need to take those out somewhere they'll be appreciated. <laughs> <clears throat> Thanks for all this. Who's coming in? Who's the surprise? Mick? He ain't here, is he? I've texted him, maybe about half hour. He ain't actually Prince Harry, is it? <laughs> We're the farmy, charmly army lad. Stuart! Yes! <laughs> Your brother's on his way! 